What's going on with the guys? So I know it's been a little bit since I dropped a video. Um, I apologize for that. My laptop is being worked on right now, so hopefully there's a quick fix to it. I got a lot of fun stuff coming out on the channel very soon, so um, definitely stay tuned. But I do want to touch on the whole Telen Smith thing. As you all know, Telen Smith hasn't been reporting to the voluntary workouts and stuff like that. And then uh, when interviewed, Dave Caldwell said that he hasn't been in touch with him and basically hinted that, oh, he might not be on a team next year. I don't know. He's he's saying a bunch of stuff like that. So there's a lot of speculation on what's going on with this. Now, Telman Smith did finally speak out in the ways. He went on um, Instagram Live and said that he'll always be in Duval, Duval till we die and stuff like that. He ain't ever leaving. So all that's interesting. So we'll see what's going on with Telvin Smith. I mean, I've, I know I really go back and forth on the whole topic of should players be at voluntary workouts? Should they not be at voluntary workouts? And, you know, I was along the lines of where I think that they should be there. Although, you know, I see why they also choose not to go. I mean, Isaiah Crowell, the Raiders running back towards ACL or something like that. And he's out for the whole entire year. So if these guys get put in situations where they don't feel like they're all that ready to go there and they kind of feel pressure to go then then they're forcing a weird situation and um i i at their next cba man there's no they're going to rule out this optional stuff they're probably going to limit the amount of times they're able to have practices like maybe they do six otas that are mandatory as opposed to doing this voluntary crap but yeah then telman smith's saying all this and uh We'll see what happens with Telvin Smith. I mean, I know there's been a lot of talk of should we trade this guy, should we not trade this guy. I'm along the lines of, like, I wouldn't mind keeping him, but I'm also team extend Yannick Ngakwe and Jalen Ramsey at all costs. And if at all costs means that you have to get rid of a guy like Telvin Smith, then get rid of Telvin Smith. I know the linebackers, we've signed a lot of linebacker depth. None of them are as good as, uh, as Telvin Smith, but at the same time, man, um, I want to keep Yannick Ngakwe and Jalen Ramsey, and if the Telman Smith contract is holding us back from doing that, then I don't want to keep him. You know what I'm saying? Uh, hopefully we find an extension for Yannick Ngakwe this offseason. Then next offseason we can work on Jalen Ramsey. We'll see about Miles Jack. I love Miles Jack, but at the same time, he's not at a super premier position. So uh, we'll see what happens there. But um, Telman Smith does finally speak out. He's a leader of our team. So we'll see what happens along the lines of that. So, yeah, thanks guys for watching. More to come later. And I'll catch you guys next time.